I am extremely happy that Aditya L1 is uh, um, injected into the intended orbit flawlessly by PSLV as always. As India's Aditya L1 is in its final orbit, meet the driving force behind the space mission. Mainly for the study of all the major solar events, we have uh, suit up seven instruments and uh, they will be uh, looking at uh, coronal mass ejection, solar flays and uh, solar wind studies. And it's to have an understanding of all these major events and its influence on the space weather and also to have a good understanding of the coronal heating. So these are all the major objectives and we have in-situ particle measurement uh, 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 payloads too so they will be measuring and uh, it will be can give up popularly known as one of the sheroes at isro nigar shaji led the aditya l1 mission successfully along with her team she is known for her charming smile that can tame the fiery sun nigar shaji was born to a mathematician turned farmer in tamil nadu well just like every other household nigar's parents wanted her to take medicine but she chose engineering and graduated from Tiruvannali Government Engineering College. I always like to do what uh, many are not doing. So that way I chose engineering at that point of time. Now every a lot of women are doing. So at that, that point of time, it was not uh, very, uh, very a common one. So I like to do that. How many, how many women were there in your class when you were doing engineering? Yeah, we were, uh, the total strength of 120, 100 are male and 20 are female. After completing post-graduation in Birla Institute of Technology, Nigar went on to don multiple roles at UR Rao Satellite Center in Bengaluru. Later, Nigar started working with ISRO. After that, there was no looking back for Nigar. She went on to work as an Associate Project Director for ResourceSat 2A. Besides making Aditya's L1 mission a successful project, Nigar is working on two more projects including Mars Orbiter Mission 2 and Chandrayaan 4. Every, globally, everyone, our space assets are uh, largely uh, manifold. It has increased now compared to the yesterday years. And this will be a good, uh, this will give uh, in addition to the global missions, whatever we have similar to the sun studies we have by NASA is a mini mission. Well, the women of ISRO have shown time and again that not just the sky, but even space is not the limit. For more informative videos like this, keep watching India Today Newsmo.